We're catching the beat. Okay, All right, hi, hello, everyone. Welcome or welcome back. If you do here, hi, I'm TK, and this is TK Talks K Bob, where we do get my reaction videos on Princess of the Jazz. Stop, 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 stop. Anyways, y'all, you see the title today. We are here to get into Anturn, um, their second mini album. Um, yeah, yeah, Uncharted Drift. That's a cool name. Interesting album cover art. Um, it's very edgy looking. <laughs> <laughs> but, but I guess, but I guess that suits the aesthetic a little bit. Um, yeah, I've got the rest of the B-sides. I already reacted to the title track. Um, long story short, loved it, loved it, loved it, loved it, loved it, loved it. Excited to see what they're gonna do for these B-sides. Gonna go with World. I believe this is the song that was in that trailer that shook me. So, <sighs> it's only two minutes and sixteen seconds, but it's not like a minute. So I guess let's we'll see. I am face to face with the world in which the boundaries of reality and dreams. It's the instrumentation for me. Is that? And then, then the narration <laughs> is very 80s. <laughs> In front. No, you don't understand. I'm gonna listen to this. In the center of rule, an abandoned the instrumental was that good. I hear a faint whisper from afar. The reason the why scent? I stand here is you. Your voice is a guide to my soul. Mm. Every step unveils an escapade, like a fairy tale. This is so dramatic. This dude should get into voice acting. Man, I wish they made that part. They extended that section out. I wish they made this into a full song. It would be up there. Come on, the flow. Edwards. Justice for world. I need this to be a full song. Isn't it even? And also, it's very epic. It's very epic. <laughs> Chad, if that was a full song, that would have been my favorite song off the album because, like, literally every single thing about it, every single thing about it, I still like it actually, though. I'm, I still like it. I'm still gonna playlist it and I'm still gonna listen to it on repeat. To like, Chad. <laughs> <laughs> and that will be going on my B-sides of the year list this year. That is the biggest case, but that is the biggest case of please make it a full song that I've had in a minute. I and I want to keep everything. I want to keep the narration. I just want you to add an extra two minutes and just let it be dramatic and... Oh, bird just landed on my window. Hi. <laughs> Make it be dramatic, it was so good. The harmonies, the layers, the instrumentation, it was crisp, it was clean. They sounded amazing. Their style, their voices suit that style so much. So well. It's a 10 out of 10 for me. Yes. 
Yes, yes. I heard people do ratings. I don't really do that, but maybe I'll start trying. <laughs> maybe I'll start trying. I didn't. Because my ratings fluctuate based on my mood, honestly and truly. But anyways, let's go um walk it out. Mm -hmm. This is about to be cultured. This is about to be cultured, I feel it. You're the beat. I love that voice cycle. Mm. You know I love the brassy sense. <sighs> I love the vocal production on this album, the layering. Yes. Ooh, this is a bit 90s as well. With some of the production choices. Yeah. I try to go to the club. <laughs> the percussion. The rappers are going on. <laughs> That's so catchy. It reminds me of something that I really I can't think of it. It's in the the chorus, that like siren like sound. I should have expected this. I should have expected this. I can't help it. It just. The, right now, the bridge is attacked. I need a warning. The percussion, the beat, the spell, all of these things. Who really is? I went for. Hellos. Keep going. Yes. Dang. I could use some more ad libs. It's good though. Yes. 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 I like entering. I like Antern. So that's how you do one of those tracks. This is how you do it. This is how you do it. The beat, the fire. Oh my goodness. The production. It was interesting. <laughs> they sounded good. The rappers went off on that one. The bridge, though. You know, the RB bridge. The RB bridge never fails to hit. The RB bridge never fails to hit. Especially when you're good at it. Like Antern is good at it. Like, like they're particularly good at it like you know like like it's not it's a sound that's used in k-pop often but like you gotta be like like sometimes groups come out and they just really have the voices for it and they really have the voices for like the like runs and riffs type of side of like r&b and like soul music so like so like the way they end their lines and stuff, like, their voices really suit that. And I'm glad that they're leaning into it, because even in the more, like, um, not R&B, like, songs that have been on this album, they've, like, sung in that type of style, and we love to see it. 
bro. <sighs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm gonna get this. I'm so happy. Yes, and turn. All right, I'm gonna move on to sketch. I enjoyed that one. It is so tough. Is that flute like sample? Yeah. I'm gonna stand. I gotta stand. We're gonna stand and turn. We're eight turn. I keep coming to the bad turn. Eight turn. The 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 pads. It's so dreamy. Wow. Just going up there with Pilot, the Pilot playlist, the NCT127. You're the flow. You, their rappers are excellent. The harmonies in the back. The production is going off, bitch. The production is going off. Ooh, the courage. This might be my favorite off the album. It's so catchy. It's been a minute since I heard one of those songs. I always call it, like, I always, like, reference NCT-127's pilot. Even though that's not, like, the first one of the, like, it's kind that exists. But, like, it's just this summery, fun, light, upbeat, R&B type of track with R&B instrumentation. And just, but it's so feel-good. It's so fun. And I just, just, K-pop does that. K-pop. Like K-pop groups, when they do that type of sound, well, it's just, it's ambrosia, it's ambrosia, it sounds expensive, it sounds luxurious, I'm trying to go on a cruise, I don't like cruises, I would never do that, but <laughs> it makes me feel like I want to go on a cruise anyway, and they did it so well, they were like right at home with that, they were right at home with that, because I feel like it's not an easy sound to make sound good, like, like, it's the type of thing that you could easily make sound boring, but they sounded good. <laughs> so I feel like that's a testament 
to their like skill job because it's not like these songs could easily sound so boring <laughs> songs like this could easily sound so boring if you don't have the delivery to keep up with the instrumental like the instrumental can easily drown you out but they just like and because the instrumental is laid back then that won't make it boring like it's just it's just love to see it love to see it <laughs> oh i still really like world though i wouldn't say sketch is current currently topping who knows who knows uh let's go ing Ooh. The whistle. The bass. Hey. Oh, I love the tempo of this. Oh, beautiful. Ooh. Ah. You see? Ooh. The guitar. Love that. Oh my goodness, the harmonies. Harmonies. The piano with the bass. Ooh, the low red sub. Wow. Ooh. The layering of the vocals. This is, I love that part. This is so good. They might be one of my new favorite rookie groups from this year. Oh, <laughs> I love this big I love that part. And, oh, vocals. Yo, mm. this I would love to see choreography to this. Piano. Oh. Disco strings too. <laughs> Vocals. Yes. Yes. The Evans. A turn is my group. A turn is my type of group. Still going. Yes. Keep going with Evans. Yes. That's cute. Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. No. 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 That's the last song. No. No. All right. There's only five songs. No. 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 Oh, my goodness. 
I mean, that's, that's going to take me a second. You'll have to bear with me. Um, no a turn. No a turn. Why? <laughs> Why? We're going to get one more. One more. Fine. 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 The mini album is a sleigh. This, but it's only their second mini album, but it's my new favorite mini album by them, which we love to see because it means they they brought some new, they improved, child. they got better, <laughs> they got better, <laughs> and they was already good. I love that. I love the piano. Love the feel goodness of it. Love the tempo. Love the production. Once again, crisp, clean. You could hear them. The vocals, layers, full, just just engaging, just fun. Fun, fun, fun to listen to. I would love to see choreography to that. I'm gonna love the piano, love the chords. Oh, this, the changes in the melody. Oh, they're very talented. Oh, they can sing, child. The talent is there. The talent is there. If I were to, if I were to rank the songs, <laughs> honestly, world well, is still my favorite. <laughs> World is still my favorite, but like I'll like I'll exclude World because you know it's not <sighs> they played us with that one, but um, excluding World, I think um, Sketch, XL, ING, Walk It Out, but I love all the songs. Those are just like. Like, like in the stuff of my enjoyment of them I will be listening to all of them and playlisting all of them <laughs> and putting all of them on repeat uh, and but if there's a good guy for a turn out now let me know because we might we might we might got to stand we might got to stand we might got to stand I fear they are my group I feel they are they are my type of group they are my type of group They've just got it. They've got, they've got what makes me tick. <sighs> I suspected it once I listened to the B-Said, it's the first album, but once I listened to this title track and this mini album, I know it. I know it for sure. I know it for sure. My type of group. Anyways, yeah, let me know your favorites down below, and uh, yeah, I'll see you on the next one. Peace. <sighs> I love